all those who have been knocked down, to all those who have been counted out, left behind, this is your campaign. Just over a week ago, many of the pundits declared that uh, this candidacy was dead. Now we're very much alive. And, and although, although there's a way to go, it looks like we're going to have another good night. With victories in Mississippi, Missouri, Michigan, and uh, we're uh, waiting to hear from North Dakota, Idaho, and Washington State. As I said from the beginning, this election is the one that has character on the ballot. The character of the candidates, the character of the nation is on the ballot. It's more than a comeback, in my view, our campaign. It's a comeback for the soul of this nation. This campaign is taking off, and I believe we're going to do well from this point on. Take nothing for granted. Want to earn every single vote in every single state. But if you're willing, if you want to join us, go to JoeBiden.com. Sign up. Sign up. Volunteer and contribute if you can. We need you. We want you. And there's a place in our campaign for each of you. And I want to thank Bernie Sanders and his supporters for their tireless energy and their passion. We share a common goal, and together, we'll defeat Donald Trump. We'll defeat him together. We're going to bring this nation together. We're regenerating a Democratic base, the Democratic Party the African-American community, high school-educated folks like the ones I grew up with in Claymont, not far from here, in my old neighborhood, labor, suburban women, veterans, firefighters, union members, and so many more, people of every economic station, the poor who are struggling, and they are struggling in this environment, the middle class who worries about whether or not they're going to be able to hang on and stay there, maintain their economic security. They're the reason Jill and I got involved this, in this campaign in the first place. And they're the reason why I became a Democrat so long ago. And I can't tell you, I really mean this from the bottom of my heart, I can't tell you how much I appreciate the confidence they've shown in me thus far and the way they turned out to vote for me. In my first campaign, when I was a kid, a <laughs> long time ago, I had a billboard that said one thing on it had a picture of my wife and children, and it said, for all our families. That's all it was, for all our families. That included Democratic families, families of independent voters, Republican families, everyone of every stripe, for all our families. And look, that's what we were able to accomplish in South Carolina. That's what we did on Super Tuesday. And it appears, although it's a little premature, it appears that's what we're able to do tonight. In just the past week, so many of my incredibly capable competitors have endorsed me. Mayor Pete Buttigieg, Amy Klobuchar, Beto O'Rourke, Mike Bloomberg, Cory Booker, and Kamala Harris. Together, together we're bringing this party together. That's what we have to do. Tonight, we are a step closer to restoring decency, dignity, and honor to the White House. That's our ultimate goal. Yeah.